Yo, what's the deal? We gonna be coming back with a new video now. I think today's video is gonna be five reasons why I hate my car. Now this is a beautiful 2015 SRT392 with peanut butter seats, but the car do got some flaws. We gonna get into that very, very, very soon. Now it's only right to go get a car wash. I cannot showcase y'all a car without a car wash. Look at them. Can't drive, man. Come on, not huh? But anyways, we got a full tank of gas, you know what I'm saying? We got a full tank, look at that. Hold on now, hold on now. Okay, boom. Now for a full tank of gas, 181 miles, I don't know if that's too good. Oh my God. I don't know if that's too good or not, but we have seen. I have had this car for a little over a month and I pretty much know the ins and the outs. I pretty much learned the car about everything about it, so. I'm gonna let y'all know why I hate this car now. <sighs> we gonna just get into the video, man. Now, before we even go to the car wash, we need some wheel cleaner. I would pass it, but it's okay. We can go this way. I need some wheel cleaner because the the um brake dust from these Brembo's is just insane. Like it's crazy. Now I just need something that'll go on the rooms and that'll like clean itself. I give me a little brush because. I got to clean the calibers too. The calibers are so freaking filthy. It just doesn't make any sense. So, yeah, I'm going to go in here real quick. Try to find like a little wheel brush. I got a brush to scrub my tires. I don't want to put that hard um, bristle on my rims. I've already got like my, my uh, clear coat peeling. So, I don't want to make nothing happen any worse than what it should be. But, anyways, we're pulling up here right now. I'm going to switch to the phone for a second i'm gonna see what they got in there for me now i do have some more incense i'm gonna put up there because these incense are like can't even smell it no more so we did go with the strawberry and the black ice which was it was it was a nice little mixture and nice like little blend but i don't know i'm gonna go in there and see what else they got for us and like i want something else like the black ice is always good black ice and uh new car scent is always like the top tier but I'm gonna try to go with something else instead of strawberry. So yeah, cause the car is on stink. It just doesn't like smell good as it as it did with the scent. So we're gonna swap these scents out. And I kind of want to do like a little mini detail for y'all for the car, you know. And then yeah, so I'm gonna see y'all in a second. We're gonna run in here, run out quick, fast, in a hurry. So we see y'all in a second. All right, so let's see what they got going on. And we just need like some good old. Do we need some out this? We got floor mats. We don't need a steering wheel cover. We need an oil change pretty, pretty soon. Let me see. Wheel locks, no. No, no, no. No, look, he needs some, some of these. I had some of these for the 300. Ain't no throwing them away. Let me see, we need one of these. Let me see. Y'all not gotta go with the cheaper option, you know? <laughs> but, uh, we definitely gonna get some rags. And like a wheel. Brush, so I can use. I want something to just stick in it. I gotta get the calipers too. So, something like this, I guess. Boom, this wheel wand, or I like how this feel more. So, y'all, this is the wheel brush we're gonna go with to clean the wheels and the caliper. This is gonna be the rim cleaner we're gonna use. This look like it's gonna be pretty good, so we're gonna see after we get the wash. So, y'all, we got what we need. Let's get a little warm start for y'all. Hold on. We need a monthly, not too bad, man. We do need a mere monthly, like so freaking bad. It ain't even giving what I want to really listen for, you know. Make sure this shit. Okay, it's open. So, like I told y'all, y'all see the clear coat is like peeling on this, so it'd be all right. We gotta get the rims painted one day, or maybe get to get different rims. But this is the wheel cleaner right here. It should smell kind of fire. We need to get this on the. Calibers too. Then we just gonna take this on back here. It's like try to clean because the shit is like dirty. I don't gotta record all this. Y'all know what we gonna do. Hey, shit up, TNT.
how good y'all can see, but the calibers and the wheels look way better. Like these rims are a different color without no brake dust. So we got the car cleaned up pretty nice and good. Now I'm gonna put a little bit more wheel cleaner on the car just so it can help me because I'm about to go through the touch list. So I'm trying to get the rims, look at that 5-0. I'm trying to get the rims clean as possible. And then we're gonna go on about our day. Did a bug survive a water storm or? No, that's crazy. Five, I don't think he's making some noise. He wanted to do nothing with the SRT. Just like that, we just put the tire cleaner back on and we gonna close the trunk, go through the touch list. Y'all wanna see how this boy sound with like it being enclosed. Let's give it a start. Yeah, five. I tell y'all it's hot as hell out here. Michigan have not been letting up on us, man. But I'd rather be hot than cold, you know? So we'll be all right. No, 11.1 miles per gallon is crazy. Like, did I buy a, a, a Hellcat or is this a, a, a red eye or is this, is this a super stock? Like, no, this is crazy. I'm like, Rylo had the hardest album of the year. Now I heard Rob Wade was driving on the 21st, you know, but we gonna see, cause I, I got faith in Rob. But so far, my guy Rollo got, got him beat. 300 in there getting washed. Oh, sheesh, I'm finna take the front bumper off. Hold on now. God, I, I am at like the whole wrong angle to be trying to go in here, but we gonna see. Oh yeah, I'm about to tear something up. Damn, do I got it? I got, they got to make this bigger because it ain't no way I should have to squeeze this charger in. Imagine if I was a wild body with 305s, you know, flared fenders, stuff like that. Like, I'm damn near about to hit that. But we got to pull on back and I got to cut the video for a second to scan my phone for the car wash. Get the wheels good, man. Whoa, all right, park, park. Don't, don't, don't mind the work shoes. And, and the paper towel, that's just a whole different story. But yeah, we're gonna let this do what they gonna do. Oh, I got a package that's supposed to come today. No, in a couple of days. So I just got the message on my phone that I'm recording on my phone. So I'm sure that's a, that's a mod. I've been ordering mods again, like sponsored by mods, so freaking crazy. So we do got some crazy stuff coming in the works. Y'all just gotta, you know, stick around and see. I'm not telling y'all we got a lot of stuff coming, like crazy stuff, like I already got the strikes. I didn't say it too much. I didn't say it too much. So we gonna just face it back this way. I didn't say it too freaking much. And what are we gonna do? So y'all just, just just stay tuned. Y'all stick around. Y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Support the movement. And you know we gonna go up. So yeah, look at the look at the look at the cockpit view. So if y'all have not seen the last video, we installed ambient light all around here, all around here. I wanted to put it right here, but nobody could give me the piece for this right here. So. I'm tired of asking for people. I'm tired of looking for cars that are just for parts. I'm just going to eBay and order this my damn self because I want the ambient lighting right here. And all this is just all jacked up. But look at that. So we're going to get that fixed. So we got ambient lighting here too. All around here. Y'all know how it goes. If you ever seen the last video yet, go watch the last video. It's very good. You know what I'm saying? We got like a nice little 40 minute video. Now I'm not trying to put up videos that long, but Sometimes it might be that long because we out here recording, we out here doing stuff, blah, 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 blah. So yeah. yeah. Look at that tire shine on that. Sheesh. The calipers look way, way better now that we like clean them like the right way. But let's go ahead and get into this video. Let's go to where we're going. So I'm gonna see y'all in a minute. Look at this, y'all. I know we got some Subaru fans on the channel. That is a WRX. I'm not too good with like Subarus and know anything about them, but we got some Subaru fans on the channel on here somewhere. Police is definitely outside and they're not ready to play. They, they ain't trying to play with the boys. So guess what? We're going to go this way. Lead them going that way and stay the hell out they way. What you going to do when they come for you? <laughs> I'm going to run. You know, DVD don't want to smoke with the. Let's put it in sport mode real quick. Let's go. Big sport mode. Woo -wee. Let's see what they want to do. Come get mine. And he's going to raise hell with them. So let's go. A street. Eco. We, we got to tone the car back. Now nah, we ain't even going to get them boys hell. You know what I'm saying? 
They've been put through enough already. Right? What y'all gonna go with? The Vic SR T392, not a scat pack, or y'all can go with the C8 Vet. I ain't gonna lie. From the, from the car looks and like the appearance, I feel like the vet got it, you know. But if y'all want that raw, you know what I'm saying? That raw <laughs> American muscle, you know what I'm saying? You gonna go with the Chevy. Sight, you gonna go with the Mopar, duh. But she ain't look nice though, especially in the black. Yeah, oh, it's an old guy in that. This thing wanna pop so freaking bad. We gotta get the man month to leave out, y'all. Just wait, it's coming real, real soon. Like, we, it's coming soon. Like, when I tell y'all it's coming soon, buddy got the doors off the Jeep. He feeling good, man. Shit, what he listening to? Oh, copyright. He playing that old school shit, though. I ain't gonna lie. L look at old head. Look at old head. Old head gigging, boy. Yo, every time I come downtown Detroit, it's always something to see. Like, it's always people outside. It's always... Just something to see and just enjoy. We got a little Mustang for y'all boys. What y'all think about them 5 old? Oh, look at this big old bow. God, look. I got to go around this way. Let's see. That boy is huge. Look at that. Damn. Well, we just pulled up the bell out. I think this is a nice little spot for us to record the video. Because I don't want to keep doing the videos at the same spot. But it's a nice ass day outside, man. Thank God for the nice weather. I ain't gonna lie, cause the rest of this week is gonna be shit. They outside with a whole tent. <laughs> they got like whole tent outside. Just pulled up to Bell Isle. Now we got a nice little parking spot to do this video at. Let's turn the car off and hop up out the car because let's do the video now. So I was telling y'all we're gonna do a video of five reasons why I hate my car now. My car is not in the best condition. It is an older car. It's about eight years old. So I'm not going to be picky and nitpicking saying because I got a scratch on it or this little leg piece is bad. Like, I'm not going to tell you guys, like, oh, it's a burn hole in the seat. Oh, that's messed up. I'm not going to nitpick. I'm going to give y'all five reasons that the car will be messed up, even if it's in perfect condition. So y'all get ready and watch this. So the first reason I hate my car is it is a big 6 fold. You know what I'm saying? 392 and the gas mileage on this car is insane like i have a four take of gas and it says i have 180 miles and i average 11.2 miles per gallon but before that when i first got the car and i was going crazy i was only averaging 10.5 i'm like damn did i buy a hellcat or did i buy an srt 392 so some of y'all know me y'all know i'm not new to the the v8 scene i had a I had one car that was a v6 everything after that has been v8 so I had a 57 300 that was tuned, uh, air intake, throttle body, thermostat, a nice little build for what it was, but gas in that car was crazy. But I feel like the gas in this is crazy, but this is like a little bit better. So I'm already used to paying for a lot of gas for a V8. You know what I'm saying? Anything that's gonna be a fast or like a sports car, even in like Eco or like just the cruise mode is gonna be crazy in gas. Like that's just what it is. So just know if you're gonna get one of these cars, a 5.7, a, it could be a damn Camaro SS, a Z01, anything with a nice V8 that, that's performance car, you're going to spend money on gas. Do not get one of these cars thinking it's going to be the best car for gas because this is not. If you want that, we'll get a Honda or something. This car that you're going to have fun in and that you're going to spend gas money in. So if that's cool with y'all, then go grab one of these. If not, don't do it. Stay away from having one of these cars if you want to save money on gas. Gas is not the only problem with these cars. Like, gas is expensive. The brakes, if you got six piston Brembo's, four piston Brembo's brakes, the brakes are expensive. You know what I'm saying? That's all going to come into play. So when you think about buying one of these cars, think about the gas, the uh, how much brakes and stuff for like normal wear and tear. The maintenance oil change is easy, 100 bucks. So just keep that in mind. So the way we're going to rank this is like from like, works to like not so bad so the second thing i hate about this car i have a mopar whether you have a scat pack a track hawk a, 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 a hellcat a how you doing a trx anything mopar related and if you're in michigan like i am these cars get stolen on the daily basis i even said this last video like if you want to own one of these cars you gotta have some stuff done to it alarms and everything like that because they get stolen so much so this is why i hate this car also because Y'all can't go nowhere. I can't do a lot of stuff I want to do. I got to worry about my car 
I just be paranoid, always checking my car, looking out the window, doing this, doing that. You can't go to certain places, you can't spend a night certain places. It's just so much stuff you're limited to do with this car. So a lot of people that got these cars, they have like dailies, they have a shooter, they have another car they can run around in to keep this put up. Because you can't even go, you can't go nowhere without stressing that your car is gonna get stolen. So Dodge. I'm sure you won't be watching this video, but just in case you are watching this video, please tighten up on y'all security. Now, I know y'all made like a security um, firmware for like the new update for like the 18 and up or 17 and up, but I have a 2015. My car doesn't qualify for that. Y'all need to put something out here for my car because I do not want to worry about my car getting stolen every time I come outside. Like, imagine having one of these cars paying 30 to 40,000, sometimes up to 60,000, your car might get stolen. So this is a big reason why I hate Mopar, but I love Mopar. So it's like it's like a balance you gotta find between them. But just know one of these cars, most likely somebody's gonna steal it or try to steal it or just break into the car. You know what I'm saying? By me being in Michigan and actually like, by me being in Detroit, I have a great chance of something happening to this car, you know? so. I don't know what to say. Now, for the third reason why I hate this car, Dodge, you give us a car with 485 horsepower, 475 pound-feet of torque, and give us 245s. The car with these tires break loose so easy. If you go in track or sport mode, they break loose so freaking easy. Now, fortunately, I have an SRT and they came with 275s, but, but a lot of scat packs come with 245s. Why would y'all put 245s on a car like this with this much torque and this much horsepower? Dodge, nah, that is a big L for y'all. So the reason for y'all doing that just couldn't have made sense. Like, I don't know if y'all want to be cheap. Or what? But 245s on a car like this is, is terrible. Y'all know more parts for having fun. If you hit the gas a tad bit or launch the car, it's going to spin. So 275s, they spin also. But the 275 is a bigger and better tire for this car with the horsepower and the torque than a 245 ever will be. So that's another thing I hate. You know what I'm saying? Now, this is not all particularly about my car just for a general SRT or scat pack or whatever it is. Cause I could be nitpicking and be like, oh, I have a scratch right there. Oh, this, that, that, that. Now this car I bought with 275s, they got desert storms on them, like all the way around. So I'm guessing the owner put these on the car before he sold the car to the not like me that have one of these and you don't have a warranty, you have a scat pack Hemi tick. It's over with, <laughs> like, like get ready to spend some money. For number five, last but not least, the freaking brake dust that comes with these cars is crazy. Now, y'all say go uh, Brembo's ceramic brakes. Man, that's what we have on the car right now. And the brake dust is very, very crucial on these cars. Like, I cannot explain how much brake dust I have on this car. Like, I just cleaned the car pretty good, like y'all seen. But on a regular day, the brake dust is terrible. Like, you can just wipe your hand on it and it just smear right off. Like, it's crazy. Like, the wheels are two different colors with brake dust. And I have did everything I can do with this car. Spraying stuff on there. But the brake dust just comes on the car and, it, and it's, just, it's just terrible. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to sugarcoat none of that. You know what I'm saying? The brake dust on these cars are terrible. So, if you don't anybody keep the brake dust off the car, please let me know. I don't know if I got to go with a different brand of brakes or what but let me know because i'm tired of the break that's all freaking ready it's only been a month two hours later anyways we're gonna hop in the car Woo! i gotta get that airbag pump because it is hot turn the seat warmer i mean you know damn hold on Woo! we gotta turn this air on because when i tell y'all it is like hot outside like it is like very very hot let's see how hot it is though 83 y'all sheesh so I think I'm gonna cruise around here and go like this way. I need for my seatbelt on. I know it's gonna start making a noise. No, actually, we're gonna just turn around because I don't think it's nothing that way pretty entertaining. I'm gonna show y'all what Belle Isle looks like. So, a lot of people don't know Belle Isle is an island. We got Canada right there across the street. So, yeah, it's just a, a nice community place a lot of people come to to like barbecue, you know, go swimming. Now, if you ever been swimming in Belle Isle, you're dirty. I'm gonna keep it facts. You know, I'm not gonna sugarcoat. You're dirty. 
let's make sure nobody about to hit us. Let's go out. See how people just own runs and people be outside. It's like a nice little spot to just come outside, enjoy weather. It's not a lot of trees out here. Well, it's not a lot of shade out here, but that's the thing about it. You gotta get outside, be in the atmosphere, be in the environment, you know? So, yeah, we got a little chatty over That's the chatty scat. Oh, no, my God. Yo, I don't know if I got that good enough, but that was a chatty with a scat pack badge and um, not scat pack rims. I didn't even see brim balls, so that must have been like an up badge, which is nuts. So, yeah, look at all that water over there. Damn, no way that was a up, up badge. It's all right, you got a fake team making some time. I feel you. I got the old school Porsche out today. Two hours later. All right, y'all. Now, earlier y'all seen me do the five reasons why I hate my car. So right now we are on the way to uh, ship off these camera arms. So I bought camera arms for my Chrysler 300 to uh, fix the cameras. I had camera in the rear. I thought it was gonna help, but it was some other stuff that was broken. If y'all don't know, Go watch the videos back a while ago. We put uh, control arms and like coilovers on the 300. But anyways, we are on the way to FedEx right now to ship off these camper arms. You can show them right there in the back. They rent. So uh, a lot of y'all probably see me in like Facebook group chats. Make sure it's like angled straight. So a lot of y'all probably see me in Facebook group chats and stuff like that. And I uh, posted them up for sale. So I have them. I have the shock in the struts for the car, but I needed one of the shocks for the back. So. I have uh, two shirts and one shock. I'm trying to get another one so I can sell them as a whole. But we're on the way to ship off the camera arms right now. I, I do good business, you know what I'm saying? So I'm going to take y'all with me real quick because the day y'all seen this is going to be the day we upload the video. And I just want to get this video up real quick. So, yeah, it's been like four or five days since we uploaded. I've been just, you know what I'm saying, still trying to work and, you know, get other stuff done. But, uh, yeah, so that's what we're going to do real quick. Let me see this. So we basically just on the way to get that done and uh yeah i'm just gonna take y'all along with me for a quick little second and uh get this sent out my receipt's coming up now for you a few minutes later let me pull on in the starbucks what you want little bro frappe i think i'm gonna grab me a little refresher or something so we just got the payment for the uh springs so i think the springs are pretty much sold and now we just taking a little cruise you know what i'm saying I just wanted to just end the video off real quick because I got to get the rest of this uh, edited so I can drop this for y'all today. So uh, y'all going to see me in the same clothes for the next video. So my plan is to go home real quick and edit and then um, drop this video, come back outside because it's only 128. Y'all get this video at like 6 o'clock. So I'm going to come back outside and do another video for y'all boys. So. I guess I'm gonna see y'all in the next one. Like, comment, and subscribe. It's y'all boy eBay shot it. And we out of here, man. Uh, it's a good day to be outside, grinding, and being productive. So I'm gonna see y'all when I see y'all. Thanks for our love. Thanks for all the support. And then um, I didn't even try to grind these videos out and have fun. So once again, like, comment, and subscribe. I'm gonna see y'all when I see y'all. Turn post notice on to never miss a good video by me because I try to put on all bangers all summer. All winter, you know what I'm saying? So, hey, yo, Pluto, you going crazy? Appreciate y'all so much for sticking around. Hey, let that Let's shit ride, 88. <laughs> I ain't into the cap and let's keep it real He could've held us man down, he took a deal That's why I can't show nobody how we live I got the news from my sister, gave me chills Gang off y'all pills, fucking up parties, it's just a thrill He popped his hands and I dog itching to do a drill 